So in Mark and Sweep algorithm, garbage collector actually splits its functionality still into two parts, which is the marking and the sweeping. So in the marking process, what the garbage collector basically does is to go to the root node of your program, which is basically your process. Your, proce your program is running the process. So it goes to the root node of the process and then it marks, it begins to max all of the resource, which are your objects, all of the objects in the memory that is reachable to the process, that is attached to the process. So it begins to mark every one of them. Now during that marking phase, the garbage collector would be able to spot all of the objects that are no longer reachable to the process. Maybe for one reason or the other, they were initially spawned by the process, initialized, assigned by the process. The process was using those objects, but for one reason or the other, they are no longer reachable to the process. So the garbage